And basically all I want to do is address um, you know, functions. Just for a quick second, even though actually we're not going to be doing anything with functions. Um, but I want to go back through and at least just understand evaluating functions to kind of help us out um, in what we're going to be doing. So previously in this class, uh, we have talked about you know, function notation, having an input and an output, and you know, how to evaluate functions. So if I provide you with a function, provide you, and, and I say I want to find the value of the function at 3, we'll use this notation. And then basically, you take the 3 and you plug it in for your x. So now I can do 3 times 3 squared minus 1. Then to evaluate, I just use my order of operations. So I square the 3 first. 3 squared is going to be 9. 9 times 3 is going to be 27. Minus 1 is 26. So therefore, I can say the value of my function at 3 is 26. Does that make sense? OK. Usually, everybody doesn't really have too much of a problem 